Well, good morning, everybody, and welcome back to vlogs. Good to have you here. What's happening today, Andrew? Uh, bubble balls. Yes, we're doing bubble balls, but as you can see in the title, we're gonna try some helium bubble ball stuff today. Sounds like so much fun. We're, Andrew had a uh, brilliant idea. Why don't you tell him what you had in mind involving the helium? Well, some of you actually wrote some comments too. I don't know if this is what you meant, but this is what we're gonna do. Uh, we're gonna fill these up with helium and see what happens. Obviously, we're not gonna float away. These are like way too heavy and stuff, so we're gonna see though. I feel like this is just my guess that if we're if these are fully inflated with helium and we ran into each other, we might like not fall so hard. I don't know, something of the sorts. I don't know science, guys. We'll see what happens. We're gonna go to Party City because we called them and they said, yeah, we might be able to fill it up. So we'll see how much it costs. Otherwise, we're gonna try it, maybe buy our own tank or something. So let's go. Hi. Hi. Um, I called earlier about potentially seeing if you guys could fill this up with helium. Helium? Mm -hmm. I don't know. So I think we were right. They aren't able to fill it up with helium. But look what we found. We can make something work. Loon time jumbo helium tank. Yes. Not sure how many of these you need to fill up this. But we can at least try, right? We're gonna try. We've been waiting for Aaron to come over because he's gonna do bubble ball with us again. Andrew and I created a new game where you have to put objects on the table and if they miss or hit an object, you get to put another object on your side. So say Andrew misses, then I get to put anything I want on here, on my side. And when he serves, if he hits that, I get to put another object down and I get a point. So whoever has the most objects on the table by the end, whoever has 21 objects wins. Yep, that makes sense. We have arrived at Cottonwood Park. And again, it still looks like it's gonna storm. Ugh. That's okay. Here we go. This looks awesome. Wow. It's very light as well. By the way, kids, if you're below the age of supervision, you need supervision. So get, <laughs> whatever I just said, just know you need supervision, okay? It says, kids, warning, don't just go buy this. Safety first. It says under eight, so we'll go with that age. But just well, be careful, okay? Use your brains. Oh, there we go. That's it. So, Andrew just bought some balloons. Where are they? They're in here. Let's do a test balloon, everybody. Also, the other tip is you're really not supposed to inhale helium from a tank because it's like shooting out and you don't want that. So, so if you're gonna do helium, put it on a balloon. Don't inhale it from tank, okay guys? All right, all right. We get the point. Should I test if it's actually helium? Yeah, it could be a scam. Ah. <laughs> okay, yes it's helium everybody. We are in business. Now let's see if we can hook it up to this thing and maybe it'll work. Wow, that's good helium. This is lasting a long time, I'm not kidding. Holy cow. Oh, this is awesome. Okay guys, this is Ethan. <laughs> That is some potent helium, dude. Potent? Oh my goodness. But now we're going to try this. Potent? Potable. How is this going to work? It does. And we recommend whenever you are, if you ever try helium from the balloons, don't do just constantly. Don't do it constantly because it's really bad for your brain. So just take breaks, have fun, but be safe. Now, Andrew is taping this because we don't want to lose any helium in the process. Yeah, we want to make this work. Not sure what's going to happen, but we're here trying it out. We're, we're science men. I was about to say that. We're scientists. Oh. Trying a new theory we thought of in the lab. Here's the moment of truth. Is this going to work? It's getting bigger. Yay. Okay, well, well, I don't know how much is in this tank, but we're testing. 
It is inflating though, that's the powerful thing. It doesn't look like it's staying inflated, like it's leaving from somewhere. Yeah, he's been doing this for about 20 minutes now. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. I mean, I can feel it like getting bigger, then when I stop, it's like, goodbye. Helium is actually a type of gas that escapes from Earth. What? That's true. I am science. Build by the science guy. Thankfully, Andrew's car has hey, these guys, ports. I just sucked in some helium from the ball, and yeah. Did you just do that? Yeah. What? Hey guys, I just sucked <laughs> in helium from the ball. What? <laughs> okay, whoa, this is crazy. <laughs> All the air is escaping, dude. Yeah, you can feel it running out. Oh, wow. That's fun. Dang it, guys. This, so the Andrew's car, I don't know, this might be too powerful. It's 120 volts. That one over there, I found a cord area to plug this in, a socket in. It didn't work. Crap. What are we going to do? We found an outlet, guys. Got the pump. Now we just have one more, and then we'll go to the hill over there. Yes. Looking good, fellas. What'd you say? Bumper buddies. Yeah. You guys are bumper buddies? The, the thunder and lightning hasn't reached us yet, so I think we're all good. We found this perfect hill. It's pretty big. So, got the helium too. We wanted to make it funny by uh, having helium balloons when we roll down the hills. Come on, guys. Andrew is going first. Ah. If he could get in. <laughs> Why is this so much fun? Aww. Now, time to give some Andrew some helium. <laughs> Loon time. Is it warm in there, guys? It's not bad. Here's your balloon. Thanks. Go! <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> that was so good. Perfect. He went all the way down. I know. We should try just one. Okay, so I'm gonna go next. I'm gonna just try one bubble ball, so probably the blue one. And then what after, Andrew? Double sandwich. Yay! <laughs> I gotta fill up a balloon for Justin. Okay, here we go. That was great. These people are just rolling, just by themselves. Oh, I was like rolling on my head. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Get me out of here. Ow! I'm stuck in here. Uh-oh. What are you talking crap to me, boy? Yeah, I'm ready to battle you. You've been making me mad. Well, come get me, you idiot! Oh, yeah. God! It's a loss by one. Oh, oh. What a move to the goal by Crawford. Against, wow. against Ginobili. <laughs> He's a starter, but there he is scoring with the bench shooter. Miami has not led tonight. Chance to wow. grab it here. The ball oh, handling oh, oh. skills. Napier. Napier with some crampy handling. <laughs> Time for your daily bubble collision. Go! <laughs> There's so many bunnies right here. These are baby. Hey, baby bunnies. Ah! Okay. <laughs> what? So we've been having a lot of fun out here. What? Oh! 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 
Okay, now we're gonna try, Aaron's gonna stand right here and push the balls down the hill, and we have to jump over them. Indiana Jones stuff. Who's excited? Me, okay. Go! We're ready for you now. I'm not sure what other different things we can do on the hill, but... <laughs> I guess it's my turn to do an interview, but... I mean, it's been really fun. This is the Aaron Sandwich. Today is a sad day, but happy day for Buford. Sad because last night, he and I were playing tug of war and his rabbit got torn in half. So here's his head. So that's the sad part. The happy part is Buford, you got a new toy. Now you have Squirrel. This is Martha Stewart's pets. Squirrel. A squirrel, he makes a weird squeak. He's getting so excited. Get the squirrel! Get the squirrel! Get it, Buford! Get it! Get the squirrel! Get the squirrel! His new favorite toy. That's gonna be gone in two minutes. We'll keep you updated. <laughs> also, do you guys like my new t-shirt? Born in the 90s. Because that's me. I was born in the 90s. So they wanted me to buy this. That's why they made it. They wanted you to buy it? Yeah, they made it for me because I was born in the 90s. And he bought it today. Day. I did. I bought it today and I really liked it, so I wanted to wear it. <laughs> also bought shorts. And new shorts. Man, these are so comfy too. They're loungewear. They're not supposed <laughs> to be worn outside. <laughs> That's supposed to be a secret. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was fun. What did you think about it? I thought it was fun. I just wish we could have got the helium to inflate the whole ball. I know. That would have been funny. But We yeah. should get... Yeah, never mind. Yeah, we should. <laughs> but if you guys like this, uh, please leave a thumbs up video and we're going to be doing more bubble ball videos obviously. We already have another one that we kind of want to do so it's going to be happening soon so leave a like. Let's get this to 9,000 likes and we'll upload the bubble ball video sooner than later I guess. Yeah. Thanks for these comments by the way guys. We love these comments. Do you like this comment by the way? Andrew? I actually like this one better. Oh, okay. But, I mean, That's it's, fine. It's my opinion. Yeah. But I guess we'll see you guys tomorrow or next time. All right. Bye. Have a good one. He's ready. <laughs> Hold on. Oh. <laughs>